What does it record to? All right, I think we're ready. Hey everybody, it's, hey everybody, it's Chip from Discart. Three, two, one. Hey everybody, it's Mr. Chip from Discard to Reroll. And now, Flip Pip K, I can't even say it. Hey everybody, it's Mr. Chip from Discard to Reroll and the brand new Flip Pip KO. It's a podcast dedicated to the casual side of the Transformers TCG collectible card game from Wizards of the Coast, and we're excited to be here with a box opening. Now, you might be saying to yourself, Self, uh, we've seen a lot of box openings, and we've definitely seen uh, a lot of box openings from Wave 1, which this is Wave 1. Um, if you're new to the game, this hopefully will try to make this helpful for you, because I'm, I'm new too. And Wave 2 has come out, uh, and it's great stuff. It's the combiners and all kinds of transformers that, uh, that weren't part of my time. I'm a pretty old guy, so... Generation 1, they call it G1 in Transformer speak, uh, is more my speed. Now, the issue that I've had, I bought a lot of these boxes, and uh, right down there, this guy uh, here, Nemesis Prime. He's the one I wanted. Haven't gotten him yet. The The pull rates for uh, these secret rares or special rares are very, very hard in Wave 1. And there was two of them. There was Nemesis Prime, and there was uh, Bumblebee. And we actually did get the Bumblebee, so that's good news. But Nemesis Prime is the one I wanted, and it's a ton of money now. And I've got one more shot. This is my last box that I will do of uh, Wave 1, and we're going to go ahead and do it together. Now, I'm also looking for two other cards. Uh, I need a Grimlock, which is, of course, they're all the expensive ones. It's $40 for Grimlock right now is the going rate. Uh, this is in, uh, what is it, March 2019. And um, the other one is the um, Optimus Prime. A battlefield legend, I think that's what it is, or something like that. Bat, uh, legendary. I should check that out exactly what that is. Um, but that's the guy we need. It's the, it's the rare version of uh, Optimus Prime. Let's take a look at that. Optimus. Uh, the rare one is. Um, Battlefield Legend. I was right. Hey, everybody. It's Mr. Chip from Discard to Reroll. And now Flip Pip KO, which is a new podcast I'm doing. Did it? God damn it. Hey everybody, it's Mr. Chip from Discard to Reroll, and now Flip Pip KO, which is a new podcast I'm doing, dedicated to to yeah. Hey everybody, it's Mr. Chip from Discard to Reroll, and now Flip Pip KO, which is a podcast. Hey everybody, it's Mr. Chip from Discard to Reroll, and now Flip Pip KO, which is a podcast dedicated to the Transformers trading card game for the. Collector Casual is what I like to call myself. Uh, this here is a box of Wave 1 boosters. They have Wave 1 boosters right now, and the only other boosters they have are Wave 2 or Rise of the Combiners is what they call them. You might be asking yourself, self, why would I care about an old booster set? Well, you probably don't anymore, but um, I'll try to make it interesting for you. I bought a lot of these cards, and um, I, I really the guy I wanted was the guy uh, down here, this guy, Nemesis Prime. And we haven't gotten him. And he's also the hottest card in that set. And he's really, really uh, powerful. 
And uh, we're trying to build up the scene in my area, which doesn't exist yet, but I think it will very soon. Um, and I, you know, I bought so many of these, and I want to give this one more chance to see if I can pull it. Now, the problem is it's, a, it's one of these uh, special rares, very, very hard to get. Uh, particularly in wave one, it was extremely hard, almost one per every three boxes, not just one. So if we get one today, um, I already have Bumblebee. There was only two from wave one. And uh, so I did get lucky and, and actually pull one. I know a lot of people who bought plenty of boxes and didn't get any from wave one. So we're going to try that uh, today. There's a couple other cards that I'm looking for. Uh, Optimus Prime, of course, another one of the big money ones. That's Battlefield Legend. I needed him. Uh, and Grimlock, which is another one. He's up there in price right now. This is March 2019. He's about 40 bucks. And then Cosmos, it's, I think it's like a $10 rare. Uh, but those are the ones we're looking for. And fingers crossed, um, we get them. But we're really, this is all about Nemesis Prime. We'll keep a list of them over in the corner. And uh, here we go. It's a box opening. We're going to go ahead and cut this open right here. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Uh, I had some questions. People asked, what are these dice down here? Um, well, I used to play, well, I don't, I didn't used to play, I actually play um, Star Wars Destiny. And there's a lot of tokens and um, pieces and parts. And uh, what I like actually about um, Transformers is that there's not a lot of that. And uh, so you need life counters. A lot of people use dice. These are casino dice. You can see that they actually have um, their serial numbered right there. But they're just really big pips. Um, and, but I, as I'm looking at them on screen, the tough part, in person, they look great uh, on screen. You can kind of see through them a little bit, uh, but depending where they're on the table, these things are just, they're just fantastic. In person, again, they're they are absolutely gorgeous. All right, so let's pop these open. Uh, they're 30 in a pack, and, you know, if you're a hardcore player and you're just looking for some Transformers content, you know, and I, I appreciate you uh, tuning in and actually watching this. The problem is this is really, uh, I'm learning the game myself, so the things that I know I'll try to pass on as best as I can. Um, like what, what's a rare common, like it, it was, that was new for me. And then you're saying, well, it says it on the bottom. Yeah, but it's, it's not as obvious as normal cards. Anyway, let's pull these aside. And, uh, I've got a little camera brightness issue going on. Of course I do. It's really hard. Anybody who makes content like this, uh, they don't get a lot of credit. It's super hard to do this stuff. Uh, let's see what we got here. Sorry for my gross hands too. We're going to put the battle cards aside. Not that they're not important. They are important. Uh, but we're going to open those uh, separately. Uh, Ram, I, do you know how I have so many of this freaking card? Ramjet. It's a common. You know it's a common because right there at the bottom, uh, it says common. CT. And that happens to be card 32 uh, in the set. And there's nothing in terms of this text. This they call alt mode. For the, I mean, it says it right there, but... Uh, also, this is bot mode for the card. Most of you know that if you're watching already. But it's a Ramjet. Great. Let me go ahead and mark that down. Ramjet. I've got a little spreadsheet going. And that's Ramjet. And that's a common. So we'll just put a C down here. All right. Well, that's great. That's uh, about 50 cents. And that's pretty much my luck, everybody, uh, with... Any any pulls. Star Wars Destiny, I still haven't pulled a Yoda. I mean, it's ridiculous. Um, okay. Thundercracker. Now, he's an uncommon. It says UT right there. Thundercracker. And we get a battle pack here. These are great. Uh, I forgot who gave you the tip, but great for your kids. If you have kids like me, you're an old guy. Um, look at this terrible manicure. Sorry about that. Um, use it for the kids. Right? Or dividers. It's another thing you can do. I'm trying to fix the lighting situation here, too. Oh, well. It is what it is. Okay, next. Oh, i got to write it up. Thundercracker. This is going to be pain. i to go back and forth. Thundercracker. Thundercracker. It's coming. All right, the excitement is palpable here. Excitement at an all-time high. You think March Madness is exciting? No. Barrage. It's common. The excitement is through the roof. Through the roof. Uh, this game is just... Uh, the cards are addictive. I don't know what it is with me and like games that um, have an unusually huge 
footprint on a table. You know, Destiny is a pain in the butt. Uh, there's Jazz. Look at the foiling. Look at the foiling on that card. They're just, they're beautiful cards. Huge, too. I love them. Um, that is card number four, and it's an uncommon. It's Jazz. I'm all jazzed up. A um, little bit about me in terms of Transformers and G1 all the way. G1 all the way. 84, 11. 11 years old. I tried to watch that movie the other day. I know I know that you're probably huge fans of this thing. Um, it is it is a hard watch, man. That movie did not age well. Is this one of the rares? Please say no. Common slug. Dinobot slug. You want to see it? Dinobot slug. Uh, that's bot mode. Let's start over here. I uh, shut up autofocus, so it, it's going to focus down here. Oh, Dinobot slug. That's the uh, basically the power. Uh, that's the toughness. That's the armor. Health, I guess, is what they officially call it. And there you go. Goes up exponentially from a three to a six when you flip. All right. The slug. I'm just putting slug. That's a common. Yo, what a great box so far, huh? That means it's all the good stuff's coming. All the good stuff is coming. So, yeah, I was trying to watch uh, the Generation 1 movie. Brutal. God, it was so bad. So bad. God, geez. I don't know. I guess this guy's a meme all over the place. If you're a Transformers fan, could you leave me a comment? Sergeant Cup. What's the deal with this guy? What's the deal with Cup? Uh, there's some weird thing in the movie where these guys um, on a planet, like they talk like TV commercials from the 80s. Oh, and Blur. Blur's like the 80s guy who has, oh, I gotta write it down. Blur is the 80s guy who um, was like the fast talker. If you're like my, like over 40, uh, you understand that. Really weird. And the music, it's just, the whole thing's weird. Common Autobot Hound. Common, look at this. These are some hot pulls. Even the bad cards. I mean, they're just gorgeous looking cards. Oh, boy, this is not going well. This is exa I got to keep going from the same side. This is not what I expected. No, it's a actually, I take it back. It's about what I expected. Come on, let's get a prime right here, everybody. Nemesis prime, let's do it. Flame War, common. It's a Decepticon. Pretty much. That's pretty cool. Anyway, common. Common Diddy. Uh, what are we going to call that one? We'll call it by its name. Flame War. F-L-A-M-E. We're getting there. That's common. Um, toys? My mother always bought me and my father bought me G.I. Joe. It was kind of at the same time. And, you know, from all the things I'm learning, they uh, share a lot of the same plot points, like literally the same story sometimes. All right, it's the right color. It's not the right points. Skywarp is an uncommon. Skywarp. Sneaky prankster. Sneaky prankster. Um, so I would get the G.I. Joe toys. And my friend down the street um, would always get the Transformer stuff. And the Transformer stuff was just exponentially cooler except for like um sinestro and cobra commander and that type of stuff um and then the who was it was like snake eyes and then i forgot who was the the guy who was dressed in white who was like the evil opposite um god i forgot who that was ninja something optimus prime oh that's a freaking tease that's the common version freedom fighter that would make the whole box if i just got him That'd make the whole box for me. Prime. Common. Look at that box. Skywarp was an uncommon, wasn't it? Sorry. You'll probably say, Skywarp was an uncommon. Did I miss any other ones? Let's see. It's moving back over here. Uh, I got the microphone in a terrible spot, too. Common. Okay, what's this one? Common. Common. 
Uncommon. Jazz was an uncommon. Yeah, uh, jazz was an uncommon. We fixed it. Ooh, I can't write on that. Sorry about that. Jazz was an uncommon. We're getting there. All right, that's better. Sorry. It's just me, people. Okay. Um, anyway, we're back to the toys. Yeah, the toys were just so much cooler than G.I. Joe. But, alas, I got G.I. Joe stuff. Oh, come on. I already have this one. Not good. That's a rare. This is not going to be good. That's what I was uh, totally afraid of. The Hunt for Prime. I'm already... Let's be positive. Come on. Be positive. It's the right color. Ransack. Uncommon. It's an Insecticon. Bugs, as they're called. Bugs. We can read these later, too. We'll do a special video for that. I'm just getting nervous about this. Ransack. Uncommon. Okay, here we go. Yeah, Starscream. Now I get Starscream. I try to get him in the Rise of the Combiners. Nope. Hottest card going in that. Nope. Uh, is this how you are when you open boxes, too? Like, I'm just... <laughs> I don't mean to be a defeatist, but I'm totally a defeatist. I don't know why I keep, but you keep doing it. It's like, you know what it is? It's like loot crates. I'm not kidding. It's like loot crates. This is a good card. Mirage. When this attacks for the first time each turn and you flip at least three white pips, untap it. So there's a lot of combos there. You know, in, again, in Destiny, the, the game that I play, um, yeah, un, untapping. Or unexhausting your character. Readying, they call it, a character. Yeah, that's a big deal. Backside. When you flip to this mode, you may play an action. Yeah, playing more actions, too. This just in, that's good. I don't know if anybody's figured him out. Oh, he's what? Uncommon? Come on, give it to me. Give me something good. Don't give me a freaking that Excepticon. I know it's good, but I already have it. Oh, swoop. What is it? Common. Dinobot Swoop. Let's see it. Sorry. 10 health. 6 attack. Let's see if we can get in there. Super blurry. How about that? How's that? Is that good? <laughs> Super blurry. Sorry. When you flip to this mode, move one damage counter from this character to an enemy. <sighs> okay. I started off with all the hope in the world. All the hope in the world. And now we get another star scream. I'm screwing it all up now. Was that another? Hold on a minute. How many star screens are there? Okay. So this star scream is a common. That one's uncommon. And the uh, the other thing to note is uh, these stars down here. Um, in Destiny, it's 30 points for your characters. In Transformers, it's stars. So it's 25 is the number you're looking for. And they just introduced uh, battle cards in Wave 2 that have uh, star costs so you don't end up with uh, extra stars like left on the table. So like this is 10, this one's 11. And you can actually have both of these, which is a little weird to me. Both of these can be in your um, character lineup. Same character, but different versions of it. I don't know. I don't know if I like that. Okay. What are we at now? So how many, that's the uh, 15th pack, 16th pack. All right. We have 14 more to go. Holy cow. This is not good. 
All it takes is one Nemesis Prime, and this whole thing is just turned around. Turn this whole box opening around. Turn this whole box opening around with a rare Megatron. I already have it. But it's not a bad card. Ah, uh, Megatron. Let me see what it is. I'll read it for you. Uh, Megatron in alt mode where it starts. When you flip this to this mode, return a weapon from your scrap pile to your hand. It's got 14 health, 2 armor, 5... Uh, I don't, I don't know what they call it, attack. Um, 7, 14, and 2. This can be upgraded with a weapon in his armor and or utility slots. So it's got some versatility there. There you go. Well, it ain't going to happen. Grimlock ain't happening. Deadlock is happening. Deadlock is an uncommon. There you go. If you wanted me to open a hot deadlock, you just got it. The packs were going fast and furious now. Bombshell. If you wanted the common bombshell, you got it. There it is. Bombshell. High drama here at a box opening. From Mr. Chip. Is he going to get Nemesis Prime? It comes down to these few last packs. Or is he going to get another garbage rare? Kickback. Cunning Insecticon. That is an uncommon. That is also in my collection already. Super high drama here in New York. Here we go. What is it going to be? Is it Nemesis Prime? Is it Optimus Prime? Is it Bumblebee Common? Oh. High drama here in New York. Flip Pip KO. All new podcast. Dedicated to learning this game, Transformers TCG, by Wizards of the Coast. It all comes down to these, folks. Three, four, nine. We know there's a rare in here. But is it a super special rare? A secret rare? Nemesis Prime. Is it going to happen? The color's red. It's Sergeant Cup. Trying to set the stage here for a dramatic moment. Comes down to these. Eight packs left. Not many chances. He needs it right now. Is it Optimus Prime? Is it Jetfire, the uncommon ranged plane? It is Jetfire. Comes down to <laughs> it comes down to these. Seven packs left. Wave one. The card is red. Is it Dinobot Swoop? It is Dinobot Swoop. Oh, Nelly. We got six packs left. The dice is being rolled. Literally, we rolled them. Here we go. It's red. It's Grimlock. He pulled a Grimlock, ladies and gentlemen. It's one of the cards we wanted to get. Ring the bell. It's not plugged in. Pretend the bell has actually rung. Grimlock, big pull. Last minutes. Saved his box. The big rare. Grimlock going for about 40 biggies in the U.S. of A. Let's read Grimlock. Grimlock is 6, 12, and 2. Uh, this is bot mode, by the way. When this, it's uh, tough to read. When this does more than enough attack damage to KO an enemy, your opponent chooses one of their other characters and puts the extra damage on it. That's like trample, sort of. Uh, big time card here. Dinobot leader delivered in this box. 
when you flip to this mode, which is the alt mode, uh, one of your Dinobots gets bold three until end of turn. Bold three, that means flip three more battle cards when attacking. Great things by Wizards of the Coast. They actually describe what the words are, the keywords are on the card. Uh, fantastic card. This is a big one. Delivered. Last minutes with five packs to go. Whew. That could have gone poorly. It was heading that direction. But we'll take a Grimlock big time. We'll take a Prowl uncommon. Let's put this big daddy over here. We'll take a Prowl. If anybody needs any of these, let me know. We'll do some trading, some hot trading action. We got all these guys, which I know don't discount these cards, even though they're in weird packages. Here's the trick to opening them. See that? I've opened so many of these things. Um, and the way that these go, the rare 